What is going on guys? Skip here and welcome back to another episode in our Road to Glory series. Today we're back with some Red Bull cricket as we get stuck into the second innings of our first class match against Somerset at the Taunton ground. If you did join us last episode, you would have seen that we got off to a decent start with bat. 345 were posted on the board before we rolled Somerset for 209. The RDB, well we took three wickets, we didn't make too many runs, but today we have a lead of 242. Hopefully push that to 400 and then bring it home with the ball. Ladies and gents, there's not too much else from us at the control deck, so grab yourself a cold one, get your feet up, and continue to enjoy the career of Robin DeBank. So out comes the big fella. 2850s, 1800s, the long sleeve, a sweater collar up, and Jay Hard's rolling in on two for nine off his 3.3. We don't mess around here as we're forward and defending. A very loop be left arm is from around the wicket. We get forward again, 135 clicks. Still getting used to these sliders. Thomas rolls in wide of the wicket. Oi, we slash, we miss. Where will these first runs come from? Thomas is on. We whip legs side. Don't really know what happened there. I aimed it down to third man, but we'll take it off the legs. Do we get back for three? No, impossible at Taunton. 35 are done, and it's 1-1-3 one, one, for five. We asked for this in the first innings. Just bring a spinner on and we could be in trouble. Goldsworthy rolls in left arm over. I mean, around the wicket. That's a dot to start. If you've joined us on our live streams. The sweep shot certainly can be played to these spinners as we get on one knee. Work it beautifully. We're not going to have enough to get to the boundary, which is a little sad at Taunton. Can we get back for three? We don't. Expect that sweep to turn into a slog sweep soon enough as we work at legs side, laid out the gate, shardened door for one. We did say 400 at the top of the episode. 300 would also be nice as we get the pull shot. Forget the pull shot. That is one of the great Robin Nebeck shots for four. My days, they didn't even give us a replay. Have a look at Robin straight off the middle of the bat. And that is one bounce four. That is one of the great shots. Well, who would have thunk that? Witteveen rolls in. It's a full toss. How have we not hit that for six? We lose a wicket. Lyndon James out in the middle. Witteveen continues. We're going to have to put the foot on the gas. What is that? He's just so floaty. We step outside leg stump here and slash. Do we get the gap? We don't. So very hoopy. This time we pick him up and we work him over. Backwards square one bounce four again. Witteveen. Don't bowl there, you goose. So the taunts and crowd. Dead silence. See you later, cuz. Oh, that one cuts us in half. So the last of the 40th, we intervene in short ball. Oh, top edge, he's got us. He's got us. We're gone. We're gone. We're gone. He's got us down at fine leg. We intervene, you absolute idiot. How have we been bumped out by bloke that bowls 90 k's an hour? Oh, that makes you sick. I've picked it too. We've finally got the pull shot. And he's top edged it at Taunton down to fine leg. You absolute imbecile, Robin DeBank. Look at that absolutely pox disgusting cricket he's got to go for 13 at seven for 130 a putrid strike rate a putrid batting display over two innings toby petman rolls to the guts we get rolled for under 200 and now it is time to bring home the bacon 178 all out in the 54th it's a 314 run lead Tony DeZorzi, Will Smead, and a fired up Robin D Business. We keep the same field as last innings, but you know the rules. We don't mess around. We steam in full fast, a hint of out swing, and he drives it perfectly to the man at mid off for no run. Well, we couldn't get the ball to out swing last episode, so we'll get the inducker going. Oh, that's beautiful. Notice that the slower we bowl, the more it hoops. Oh, there we go. Beautiful stuff. We've kept Boyd in at second slip. Oh, Butterfingers last episode. Oh, good tight lines. Get that natural nip away, don't we? It's good to watch. Fifth ball in. He's forward and watch and chuck it at him. Chuck it at him. You call this an honest start. Five dots, none for none. Roll in. He snicks at bump ball. One is done and it stays at none for none. 
So back to back maidens. Good pressure start here from the outlaws as we go short. That's a back foot drive and dealt with. A good learning experience here with the sliders. Smill faces. Oh, he's done it again. At least he's good enough to get some bat on it. Full in swing up. Oh, inside edging. You probably put a leg slip in because you know a Frenchie's on its way. Oh, that is hooping. Another five dot balls. Three maidens on the trot. Dot ball pressure is a thing, but not when Will Smead's on strike because he smashes it to the boundary for four. The Zorzi, he backs up with a boundary as well. Into our third over here. Good length bowling. That is well timed. I don't think I can give Smead any width. Oh my days or anything full. That is hammered. Six runs over our head. My God. Well, I apologize. One bounce four. Now he's getting one in the jaw. Oh no, he's just lifting on that. What is happening? The last of our third, we go very wide of the crease here. And that is exactly why. Five overs are done. Beautiful comeback. And it's 12 for nothing. But the pressure finally gets to him. 13 for one. Smeed gone. The danger man. Oh, it's not going to stop the Zorzi. Though. That's a boundary through backward point. Though we've made bugger all runs. We've probably got shot of the match so far. As we just squared the Zorzi up a fraction. Seven are done. And it's 17 for one. Nine off 24. He's playing through the V nicely. We go short. There's a thick outside edge and four more. You've got to be kidding me, man. Well, look, it's bog standard four-day cricket. We cop it on the chin. We go again. We hit him on the head. It bounces over the stumps, and we have a quick word with him. Do a quick spell in and around the break, and it's 54 for one. Absolutely game on here. G. Thomas, T. DeZorzi getting a partnership together as we start our sixth, and we get hammered down the ground. Beautiful shot. Not the best of the match, but it's four runs. They're dealing with the in-swing is all right. We go back to length. And that's gone. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Robin's picked up a wicket. Quarter short mid wicket. Thank you. Thank you. Quarter short mid wicket. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, yep. Yeah. Length nipped away. Just timed it too well. Hasib Hame, good catch. It's a soft dismissal. But what is needed right now for the Nottinghamshire Outlaws? Georgie Thomas was looking threatening. See you later, cuz. And Jan Witteveen rolls to the middle. This is the wicket. We all want. Last of our six, we go exactly what all around the wicket. Don't know what I'm saying. 18 are done, and that's 58 for two. 3.16 and over. We get him again. He's off the mark. In swinger is nice. We do him all ends up. It's a fourth inning special, this. Owie. I think he did it in the first innings as well, the Dutchman. He's just not good enough. Oh, as he turns the corner, gets a single. Fair play. What's DeZorzi got in store for us? Last of our over. Back on a length, he slashes. It's a dot, 20 bold, and it's 61 for two. The very overcast now. We start another over. We to Veen drives. He gets the gap this time. He's going to get himself for boundary, small boundaries. Yes. More than happy for him just to poke the bat out at those. Can we get one to nip away? We do. We find the edge, and it's through the gap for four. That is some high-class bowling. Swing in, nip away, find the catches. This time we do second slip. Thank you very much. Robin DeBank is too good for this comp. That is just far too good. Swing in, nip away. You saw it happen first up. Just holds a fraction. Good catch in at second slip. He doesn't drop it this time. With Tavine gone, the absolute pumpkin. And now Tom Lamanby has to come and clean up. The last of our eighth, two for 29. We stick around the wicket to the lefty. He pushes the point. Dot ball, 22 are done, and she's 73 for three. We'll make that 74 for four. Fateh Singh has just gone and taken a wicket. We've got the left-handed DeZorzi, and he smashes us for four. Try and keep it fuller to DeZorzi. Nip it back, though. This time, he'll turn the corner. Give himself a single. Either hit out or get out. Last of our ninth. In swinging, Yorker is in. It's punched the man at extra cover. No run. 24 done, and it stays at 79 for four. So that was the spell. Are we going to get brought back in? Yes, we are. 147 for five. J. Rue, 11 off 19. Goldsworthy still there fighting. What's the RDB got to the left here? Thick outside edge and four more. So keeping it nice and tight round the wicket. One the nip in. Oh, he takes the pull shot on just a single down a fine leg. 
Probably due another shit catch at mid-wicket. We go short here. Oh, we square him up. It's a good finish to the 47th, and it's 1-5-2 five, for 5. A change of angle for Roo. Look comfortable with us around the wicket. This time we trap him back. He gets the single cheeky. So they're over halfway. Short ball. Oi. Putting us to sleep out in the middle. Last of the over to Roo. Nips back. He gets it fine. It's going to trickle all the way into the Toblerone. 51 done. And it's 167 for five. A 50 partnership up. Looking all right, these twos. We go full and he's done it again. Back to back. You've got to be kidding me. Yet another over in this spell. Batsman's still there as we're pumped through cover. This chase is absolutely on. Let me tell you. Well, I think it's time to go for the kill. LBW now to the left-hander. Oh, we're getting close. I wonder if this bouncer will just put a pep in his step. It's getting boring. The in-swing. Oh, we've found his helmet. Thank the Lord, something entertaining. And the classic lead to Callus. Can we find the off stump? Oh, he wedges down. So probably the last in our spell here. We've got him going. The in-swing is in. His forward looks good. 57 are done, and it's 188 for five. So we're spelled out, and that will do it. No more for the RDB as the Outlaws get the win. The extra 1,000 in the back pocket to Lyndon James. You'll be 265 Somerset rolled in the 81st over. The Outlaws getting it done by 49 runs after a bit of a shaky second dig. It was all of what Matty Montgomery did in the first innings to keep the boys alive in the season. So it's back to the menus, a good win for the boys. Where does that put us on the ladder? No, that looks like it's the one day season. It looks like we'll be headed to the Essex ground yet next. Yes, we absolutely will. Actually, we'll have another quick look at the calendar. Not too sure if we'll play the 100. We'll check it out. We'll see what we have in store, but look at that. That is what we are warming to, ladies and gents, the tour of Sri Lanka. We are going to leave it there for today's episode, guys. If you have enjoyed it, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. Leave a cheeky comment down below and make sure you swing over and catch us in one of our live streams as well. But until the next time, look after yourselves and those around you. I'll catch us in the next one.